Good morning, brothers and sisters. Welcome to the Minor Basilica of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag. We will now pray the Holy Rosary. Please kneel. O sacred feast, in, in which, which you partake, partake of Christ, Christ his, his sufferings, sufferings are remembered, our, our minds are filled with his grace, and we receive the pledge of the glory which is, which to, be is to be ours. You gave them bread from heaven to be their food. And this bread contained all goodness. Let us pray. Father, Lord, Lord Jesus, Jesus Christ, you, you gave us the Eucharist as the memorial of your suffering, of your suffering and, death. and death. May our worship of this sacrament be body, body and blood. Help, help us to experience the salvation you won for us and the peace of the kingdom where we live with the Father and the Holy Spirit, God, God forever, forever and ever. Amen. The angel of the Lord declared unto Mary, and she conceived by the power of the Holy Spirit. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Behold the handmaid of the Lord. Be it done unto me according to your word. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. And the word was made flesh, and dwelt among us. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. Pour for forth, for to beseech, we beseech you, o Lord, you, O Lord, your grace into our, our hearts, that, that we, to whom the incarnation of Christ, Christ your, your Son, Son was, was made known by the message of an angel, may by his passion, passion and cross be brought, be brought to the glory, glory of his resurrection, resurrection through the, the same Christ, Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Lord, open my lips, and my mouth shall declare your praise. God, come to my assistance. Lord, make haste to help me. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Let us meditate the five luminous mysteries. The first luminous mystery, the, pap the baptism of the Lord. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, 
now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The second luminous mystery, the wedding at Cana. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The Third Luminous Mysteries The Proclamation of the Kingdom of God Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, 
now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The fourth luminous mystery, the Transfiguration. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The Fifth Luminous Mystery, the Institution of the Holy Eucharist. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. We, fall, we fly to your patronage, O Holy, Holy Mother, Mother of God. God despise despise not our petitions and our necessities, but deliver us from all dangers, O ever-glorious and blessed Virgin. Queen of the Holy Rosary of Manawa, pray for us, that we may be made worthy the promises of Christ. Let us pray. O God, whose only begotten Son, by his life, death, and resurrection, has purchased for us the rewards of eternal life. Grant to be beseech you that meditating upon these mysteries of the Holy Rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary, we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise through Christ our Lord. Amen. Behold the faithful and prudent steward, whom the Lord has set over his household. The Lord has shown him his love and covered him with glory. He has clothed him with a splendid garment. Let us pray. Father, we entrusted our Savior to the care of St. Joseph. By the help of his prayers, may your church continue to serve the Lord Jesus Christ, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. Jubilee prayer for the golden anniversary of the Dominican province of the Philippines. O God, our Father and Creator, in whom we live and move and have our being, 
we praise you as we gather in gentle grace and gratitude on this jubilee of the Dominican province of the Philippines. O God the Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, we preach you as the way, the truth, and the life, whose name we proclaim, whose love we strive to incarnate. O God the Holy Spirit, advocate and guide, we bless you and seek the outpouring of your presence in the witness of our words and works, in the consecration of our lives to holy preaching, in speaking only to you and about you, let our celebration be filled with fidelity to our mission, with hope for your promise, and with true charity binding us all in the gospel we share with all peoples. By your will, O God, in your name, O Lord. Amen. Our Lady of the Holy Rosary, pray for us. Our Holy Father, Saint Dominic, pray for us. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Please be seated for a while. Good morning, brothers and sisters. Welcome to the Minor Basilica of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawa. Today is Thursday in the fifth week of Lent. We will now have the morning prayer of the Church integrated with celebration of the Holy Mass. We invite you to actively participate in our prayers. Please stand. Lord, open my lips, and, and my, my mouth shall declare, declare your praise. Today, if you hear the voice of the Lord, harden not your hearts. Today, if you hear, you hear the voice, voice of the Lord, Lord harden, harden not, not your hearts. Come, let us sing to the Lord, and shout with joy to the rock who saves us. Let us approach him with praise and thanksgiving, and sing joyful songs to the Lord. Today, if you hear the voice of the Lord, Harden not your hearts. The Lord is God, the mighty God, the great King over all the gods. He holds in His hands the depths of the earth and the highest mountains as well. He made the sea, it belongs to Him, the dry land too, for it was formed by His hands. Today, if you hear the voice of the Lord, harden not your hearts. Come then, let us bow down and worship bending the knee before the Lord our Maker. For He is our God, and we are His people, the flock He shepherds. Today, if you hear the voice of the Lord, harden not your hearts. Today, listen to the voice of the Lord. Do not grow stubborn as your fathers did in the wilderness, when at Meribah and Massa they challenged me and provoked me, although they had seen all of my works. Today, if you hear the voice of the Lord, harden not your hearts. Forty years I endured that generation. I said, there are people whose hearts go astray, and they do not know my ways. So I swore in my anger, they shall not enter into my rest. Today, if you hear the voice of the Lord, harden not your hearts. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Today, if you hear the voice of the Lord, harden not your hearts. Please be seated. Awake, choir and harp, with praise let us awake to dawn. 
Have mercy on me, God, have mercy, for in you my soul has taken refuge. In the shadow of your wings I take refuge till the storms of destruction pass by. I call to God the Most High, to God who has always been my help. May he ascend from heaven and save me, and shame those who assail me. My God send his truth and his love. My, my soul, soul my lions. soul lies down among lions, who devour the sons of men. Their teeth are spears and arrows, their tongue a sharpened sword. O God, arise above the heavens, may your glory shine on earth. They laid a snare for my steps, my soul was bowed down. They dug a pit in my path, but fell in it themselves. My heart is ready, O God, my heart is ready. I will sing, I will sing your praise. Awake, my soul, awake, lyre and harp, I will awake the dawn. I will thank you, Lord, among the peoples, among the nations I will praise you, for your love reaches to the heavens and your truth to the skies. O God, rise above the heavens, may your glory shine on earth. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. My people, says the Lord, will be filled with my blessings. Hear the word of the Lord, O nations. Proclaim it on distant coasts, and say, He who scattered Israel now gathers them together. He guards them as a shepherd his flock. The Lord shall ransom Jacob. He shall redeem him from the hand of his conqueror. Shouting, they shall mount the heights of Zion. They shall come streaming to the Lord's blessings. The grain, the wine, and the oil, the sheep, and the oxen. They themselves shall be like watered gardens. Never again shall they languish. Then the virgins shall make merry and dance, and young men and old as well. I will turn their mourning into joy. I will console and gladden them after their sorrows. I will lavish his choice portions upon the priests, and my people shall be filled with my blessings, says the Lord. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The Lord is great and worthy to be praised in the city of our God. The Lord is great and worthy to be praised in the city of our God. His holy mountain rises in beauty, the joy of all the earth. Mount Zion, true pole of the earth, the great king's city, God in the midst of its citadels, has shown himself its stronghold. For the kings assembled together, together they advanced. They saw at once they were astounded. Dismayed, they fled in fear. A trembling seized them there, like the pangs of birth. By the east wind you have destroyed the sheep of Tarshish. As we have heard, so we have seen, in the city of our God, in the city of the Lord of hosts, which God upholds forever. O God, we ponder your love within your temple. Your praise, O God, like your name, reaches to the ends of the earth. With justice your right hand is filled, Mount Zion rejoices. The people of Judah rejoice at the sight of your judgments. Walk through Zion, walk all around it, count the number of its towers, review all its ramparts, examine its castles that you may tell the next generation that such is our god our god forever and always it is he who leads us glory to the father and to the son and to the holy spirit as it was in the beginning is now and will be forever amen please stand let us pray be near, O Lord, to those who plead before you, and look kindly on those who place their hope in your mercy, that, cleansed from the stain of their sins, they may persevere in holy living and be made full heirs of your promise. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you 
in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God forever and ever. Amen. Amen. Please be seated. A reading from the book of Genesis. When Abram prostrated himself, God spoke to him. My covenant with you is this. You are to become the father of a host of nations. No longer shall you be called Abram. Your name shall be Abraham. For I am making you the father of a host of nations. I will render you exceedingly fertile. I will make nations before you. Kings shall stem from you. I will maintain my covenant with you and your descendants after you throughout the ages as an everlasting pact to be your God and the God of your descendants after you. I will give to you and to your descendants after you the land in which you are now staying, the whole land of Canaan as a permanent possession, and I will be their God. God also said to Abraham, on your part, you and your descendants after you must keep my covenant throughout the ages. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. The Lord remembers his covenant forever. The Lord remembers his covenant forever. Look to the Lord in his strength. Seek to serve him constantly. Recall the wondrous deeds that he has wrought, his portents and the judgments he has uttered. The Lord remembers his covenant forever. You descendants of Abraham, his servants, sons of Jacob, his chosen ones, he, the Lord, is our God. Throughout the earth, his judgments prevails. The Lord remembers his covenant forever. He remembers forever his covenant, which he made binding for a thousand generations, which he entered into with Abraham and by his oath to Isaac. The Lord remembers his covenant forever. Please stand. If today you hear his voice, harden not your hearts. The Lord be with you and with your spirit. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to John. Glory to you, O Lord. Jesus said to the Jews, Amen, amen, I say to you, whoever keeps my word will never see death. So the Jews said to him, Now we are sure that you are possessed. Abraham died, as did the prophets. Yet you say, Whoever keeps my word will never taste death. Are you greater than our father Abraham who died? Or the prophets who died? Who do you make yourself out to be? Jesus answered, If I glorify myself, my glory is worth nothing. But it is my father who glorifies me, of whom you say, He is our God. You do not know him. But I know him, and if I should say that I do not know him, I would be like you, a liar. But I do know him, and I keep his word. Abraham, your father, rejoiced to see my day. He saw it and was glad. So the Jews said to him, You are not yet fifty years old, and you have seen Abraham? Jesus said to them, Amen, amen, I say to you, before Abraham came to be, I am. So they picked up stones to throw at him. But Jesus hid and went out of the temple area. 
Brothers and sisters, the Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Please be seated. Good morning and welcome to the Minor Basilica of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag. Nakita ang dalawang magkumpare, si Jose at si Juan. At sabi ng isa, alam mo pre, nabalitaan ko, ang tapang pala ng kumpare natin si Pedro. Imagine, nakipagsaksakan sa tap sampung tao. Alam mo yung mga maton doon sa ating kanto? Dumaban siya doon, sampu yun. Nakipagsaksakan siya. Sabi ng isang kumpare, talaga, ang tapang nga. Saan mo naman nabalitaan yan? Sabi ng nagbalita, doon sa bahay nila, nakaburul siya ngayon bukas ang kanyang libing. Alam niyo mga kaibigan, mga kapatid, sabi nila, sabi lang nila, hindi ko alam kung sasangayon kayo, kapag kami pinaglalaban ka sa buhay, kailangan mong dalawang bagay, at least. Una, tapang. Ikalawa, talino. Yung tapang, yung kaya mong sumugod, lumaban, umabante, umatake. Tawag natin sa English dyan, It's not simply bravery, but courage. The ability to pursue, even in difficult times, situations and moments, that which you desire to achieve. Courage. Courageous. Kailangan ang tapang. Pero dapat, i-balance yan ng talino. Hindi simpleng kaalaman. Sa ating Pilipino, ang tawag dyan, wais. Sa tilohiya, ang tawag dyan ay prudence. To know when to withdraw. Especially when you know, you know that you are losing the battle or the fight. Yung bang alam mo, kailan ka susugod, pero alam mo rin, kailan ka aatras. Sabi ng ibang tao, ng ibang manunulat, it is part of courage to withdraw. To run away. Matapang ka nga, pero sugod ka lang ng sugod. Ang tawag natin dyan minsan, katangahan, kalokohan, kabobohan. Kailangan marunong ka rin. Alam mo kailan aatras. Pinakita yan ng ating Panginoon sa ating Ibanghelyo sa araw na ito. Sa dulo ng Ibanghelyo, Sinabi na si Kristo ay nagtago. Jesus hid and went out of the tem temple area. May banta sa buhay niya. Gusto siyang patayin, gusto siyang bat batuhin. But he knows his time. He knows the will of the Father. He knows what he's supposed to do. To run away is not against courage. Hindi siya katakutan you should not be afraid sa buhay natin mga kaibigan mga kapatid minsan tayo sugod lang ng sugod kailangan din natin ng talino halimbawa sa mga mag-i-exam dyan o pupunta ng abroad siyempre andun yung tapang go for it go for it pero kapag halimbawa sinabi ng gobyerno bawal muna dahil sa covid Atras-atras din pag may time. Kapag kami gusto tayo sa buhay, sige, kunin natin. Gustuhin natin yung mga gusto mag-asawa. Pero alamin natin kung anong kahinatnan, anong pupuntahan, anong mangyayari sa atin. Sigurado ka na ba sa taong yan? Sigurado ka bang single yan? Etc., etc., It's also prudent and wise to back out, to withdraw. May isang bagay lang, mga kapatid, lalo-lalo na ang tukso na dapat nating atrasan. Sabi ng mga spiritual writers, in all the temptations in life, we have to move forward. We have to fight to confront the temptation. We have to be courageous. But there is only one. Nakapagkayo na itukso, kailangan atrasan. Ano yon? 
yung tinatawag natin sa Tagalog, tukso sa laman. The temptation of the flesh. Sa mga may asawa, sa mga seminarista, mga madre, kapag ka ang tukso na, itukso sa laman, is more wise to run away. But otherwise, we have to fight. We have to move forward. Kaya mga kaibigan, mga kapatid, sa ating buhay, ipagdasal natin ang dalawang bagay na ito. Tapang para makamit ang kaligtasan, magawa ang kalooban ng Diyos. At talino, prudence, para tayo tumakbo. Let us pray for these two. We pray for courage, we pray for prudence, that hopefully with them, we can attain heaven. We stand. Let us present our petitions to Jesus, who guides us in our journey of faith to the Father. We say, Lord, hear our prayer. Lord, hear our prayer, that God's kingdom may exist within the hearts of those who recognize Jesus' presence. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. That through Jesus, we may receive the strength to journey in faith as Abraham did. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. That our faith may be clearly evident through Jesus' action in our hearts. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. That the sick and those who are in trouble may acknowledge Christ's presence who accompanies them in their journey. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For our Pope, the College of Bishops, parents, relatives, benefactors, and for all of those whom we promise to pray, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For justice, peace, and development of the country, and for our brothers and ministry at San Lorenzo Ruiz and Most Holy Rosary, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For the intentions of devotees and pilgrims of Our Lady of the Holy Rosary of Manawa, and for our personal intentions. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. That Lord the faithful, God. That the faithful departed may reach their eternal home. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. Lord God, grant our petitions and sustain our faith as we journey through life, that our reunion with you may be joyful. We ask this. Through Christ, our Lord. Amen. Amen. Please be seated. Blessed are you, Lord, God of all creation, for through your goodness we have received the bread we offer you, fruit of the earth, and work of human hands. It will become for us the bread of life. Blessed be God forever. Blessed are you, Lord, God of all creation, for through your goodness we have received the wine we offer you, fruit of the vine, and work of human hands. It will become our spiritual drink. Blessed be God forever. Please stand. My brothers and sisters, that may sacrifice on yours may be acceptable to God the Almighty Father. May the Lord accept the sacrifice at your hands for the praise and glory of His name, for our good and the good of all His holy church. Look with favor, Lord, we pray, on these sacrificial offerings, that they may profit our conversion 
and the salvation of all the world. Through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Lift up your hearts. We lift them up to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. It is truly right and just, our duty and our salvation, always and everywhere to give you thanks, Lord, Holy Father, Almighty and Eternal God. For you will that our self-denial should give you thanks, humble our sinful pride, contribute to the feeding of the poor, and so help us imitate you in your kindness. And so we glorify you with countless angels as with one voice of praise, we acclaim. Indeed, holy, O Lord, the font of all holiness, make holy there for these gifts, we pray, by sending down your Spirit upon them like the Jew form, so that they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion, he took bread, and giving thanks, broke it, and gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice, and once more giving thanks, he gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it, for this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. The Mystery of Faith For as we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, giving thanks that you have held us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly we pray that partaking of the body and blood of Christ, we may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church prayer throughout the world and bring her to the fullness of charity, together with Francis, our Pope, and Socrates, our bishop, and all the clergy. Remember also our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection, and all who have died in your mercy. Welcome them into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray, that with the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, with the blessed apostles, and all the saints who have pleased you throughout the ages, we may marry to be co-heirs to eternal life and may praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. Through him and with him and in him, O God, Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, 
All glory and honor is yours, forever and ever. Please so stand. At the Savior's command and formed by divine teaching, we dare to say, Our Father, who art, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Deliver us, Lord, we pray from every evil, graciously grant peace in our days, that by the help of your mercy, we may be always free from sin and safe from all distress, as we await the blessed hope of the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Lord Jesus Christ, who said to your apostles, Peace I leave you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, and graciously grant our peace and unity in accordance with your will, who live and reign forever and ever. Amen. The peace of the Lord be with you always. And with your spirit. Let us offer each other the sign of peace. Peace with you. Lamb of God, you, you take, take away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, grant us peace. Please kneel. Behold the Lamb of God, behold him who takes away the sins of the world. Blessed are those called to the supper of the Lamb. Lord, I am not worthy that you should enter under my roof, but only say the word and my soul shall be healed. The body of Christ. Amen. Please kneel. Prayer for the elections. Let us pray that the forthcoming elections may truly reflect the will of the Lord who guides the destinies of nations. Let us pray together. Deliver us, Lord. 
deliver us, Lord, from coercion, violence, and terrorism. Deliver us, Lord, from dishonesty, lies, and all distortion of truth. Deliver us, Lord, from bribery, graft, and all conspiracy for fraud. Deliver us, Lord, from threats, intimidation, and perverse language. Deliver us, Lord. Let us pray together. Hear us, Lord. Hear us, Lord, that conscience may always be our ultimate norm. Hear us, Lord, that the common good may always be our highest goal. Hear us, Lord, that human dignity may be respected all the time. Hear us, Lord, that the poor and the weak may always have the priority. Hear us, Lord, the genuine fear of God and love of neighbors may guide those to seek public office. Hear us, Lord. Let us pray. Shepherd of souls and Savior of the nations, politics is your gift to us, a call to serve others. May our political engagement for voters and candidates bring glory to your loving name and help us grow in holiness forever and ever. Amen. Amen. Please stand. Jesus said to the chief priests and the crowds of the Jews, Whoever comes from God hears the word of God. You will not listen because you do not come from God. Blessed be the Lord, the God of Israel. Yes, he has God. come to his people and set them free. He has raised up for us a mighty Savior, born of the house of his servant David. Through his, his holy, holy prophets, prophets, he promised of old that he would save us from our enemies, from the hands of all who hate us. He promised to show mercy to our fathers and to remember his holy covenant. This was the oath he swore to our father Abraham, to set us free from the hands of our enemies, free to worship him without fear, holy and righteous in his sight all the days of our life. You, my child, shall be called the prophet of the Most High, for you will go before the Lord to prepare his way, to give his people knowledge of salvation by the forgiveness of their sins. In the tender compassion of our God, the dawn from on high shall break upon us, to shine on those who dwell in darkness and the shadow of death, and to guide our feet into the way of peace. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Jesus, Jesus said to the chief priests and the crowds of the Jews, Whoever comes from God hears the word of God. You will not listen, because you do not come from God. Let us pray. Nourished by your saving gifts, we beseech your mercy, Lord, that by this same sacrament with which you feed us in the present age, you may make us partakers of life eternal. Through Christ, our Lord. Amen. Amen. Please be seated for some announcements. Dear devotees of Our Lady of Manawa, the summer feast of Our Lady of Rosary of Manawa will be on May 4, 2022 third Wednesday after Easter Sunday. The Novena Masses will be scheduled at 6 a.m., 7.30 a.m., 9 a.m., 10.30 a.m., 12 noon and 4.30 p.m. from April 25 to May 3, 2022. Additional Mass at 3 p.m. on May 1, Sunday. We invite you to participate in these Novena Masses. If you wish to sponsor, one or several Masses, you may fill out the form at the counters for Masses area and submit it with your donation, where you will be provided with an acknowledgement receipt. Or you may visit our website, www.manawagminorbasilica.org, for the online PAMISA. All names of donors and sponsors will appear in electronic souvenir program. Thank you very much for your continued support. God bless you. Please stand. Maraming salamat po sa inyong pakikisa at pagdalo sa misang ito. Naway sa inyong pag-uwi. Bitbit nyo ang biyaya ng Diyos Ama, 
at ang mga panalangin na mahal na ina. The Lord be with you and with your spirit. May Almighty God bless you, the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. The Mass is ended. Go in peace. Thanks, Thanks be to God. Prayer for the blessing of the sick. God, our Almighty Father, by your blessing, you give us strength and support in our frailty. Turn with kindness toward our sick brothers and sisters. Free them from all illness and restore them to good health through the intercession of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag, so that in the sure knowledge of your goodness, they will gratefully bless your holy name. We ask this through Christ, our Lord. Amen. Amen. Prayer for the blessing of religious articles in memory of the mysteries of the life, death, and resurrection of our Lord Jesus Christ and to the honor and glory of the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of Christ, Mother of the Church, Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag. May these rosaries, images, candles, oil, and other religious articles be blessed and made holy in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen.